assalamu alaikum viewers hope you are will be fine today our topic is how to set up the print uh, layout in primavera p6 because most of our uh, friends don't know how to set up print save permanently the uh, primavera uh, print setup in primavera p6 so we will start i have opened my primavera p6 20.12 you can see here I already shared this project, Villa project, on uh, uh, this lecture is already on YouTube. You can see, first of all, we will set up a print, which is our today topic. Just to go here, you can see here the print preview setup. Okay, you can go print, click on it. Okay, now you can see the, the uh, default uh, print setup. I will change it just uh, on page setup. This one is page setup okay open it first of all you can select the page uh, most of uh, we mostly use the paper a4 then select here the paper a4 then adjust to whatever you want adjust to first of all you can see the apply and see the behavior of the uh, your okay apply and it is okay and then you can select the uh, fit time scale tool yeah I want time scale in one page, on the one page which I am ready to see what is the okay, time scale is here. Now you can set the margins of the page. Uh, no need to too high margins. Okay. Just select 0, 0 and then we can see the behavior of the zero, 0 0.1. Okay. Then 0 0.1. I need 0 0.1. No, not, not accepting. Okay. We just 0 0.25, 0 0.25, 0 0.25. Okay. Okay. Then okay. Apply. Yeah, it's okay now. Now the header. The header, whatever you want. I am uh, preferring to do divides in headers first of all here you can see divide into two portions apply you can see here there are two portions okay then height of the header uh, i prefer 0 0.50 then according to the logos you can set whatever your logo okay we will change it then the first is this one okay what you want i want text or logo okay modify here Write your project uh, project name here. Uh, just say uh, Villa project. Villa uh, house project. House project, and I'm preferring to write enter. What is this? The construction schedule. Construction schedule schedule for house project. Okay, you can change the fonts, each and everything. Bring into it's okay. Here. Then you can change the fonts setting. I prefer the real black, bold italic. Okay, twelve is okay for me. Okay, then click okay. Okay, you can see here. Apply and see the behavior. Construction schedule will start coming. Then you can see that there one now it's okay. Also, you can change here from here. Select this one if you want to modify, select all which one you color. You can change the colors, underline, sample is there. You can see if you want underline, underline line is coming. You don't prefer the underline, then okay. Okay, apply again. Okay, in the second portion, I want to. Add my company logo, client logo, which which consent and companies and involve. First of all, modify. First of all, modify. Okay. Then you have to select if you want a logo or something. Here, yeah, go to here. Picture source. Yes. Okay. I will give the picture source from desktop. Desktop is here. I already uh, put the desktop. I create download one. Uh, Client logo from internet. Okay. 
Okay, client logo is here. It's okay. All right. One. Give the spaces some spaces. Whatever you want. One, two, three, four, five. So five spaces is enough. And then the contact logo, your logo. If there is any call content, you can add the logo the call content also. It's necessary because the call content logo is also necessary for that that purpose. Okay. Equal. Okay. Let's check it. What is the behavior? Not coming. We need to reduce the size of the logos. Okay. Okay, check it manually. We still need to re reduce. Okay, then apply. If you want to add name under the logo, it's possible. If you want to only set with the logos, it's okay and acceptable according to the standards. You can see here the logos also you can change the location of logos here okay it's go to the other side it's okay if there is if you want to add some more logos with small it's okay you can add and then the footer the footer mostly i am adding what how to add uh, i am divided in four because i have to write more and different information in the footer it's necessary to cover the uh, first of all can chart legends okay font you can set the font of the can, can chart, uh, legends also you can check here whatever you select here Arial black okay font okay Arial uh, bold and alec okay then it is okay i think if not coming you can see here the footer go a little bit here then again go to the page setup it's not coming completely we have to reduce the size of the your font because it's uh, uh, also you can arrange with the like that uh, the spacing section uh, width like that okay now we have to again reduce the font size it maybe you can write here the six you can read all the legends of the your page get that here okay six no seven it needs to seven you can arrange as per your uh, size and requirement okay apply now i think it's okay then uh, the second is section two here uh, i am also preferring the page numbers if your schedule is too long then you have to see the page numbers apply i preferring this one you can reduce the width of this section and page number will be modified just enter because it came in width uh, in mid of the uh, your section okay if you want here 0 0.6 it's also okay you can write here mostly we're writing what 0 0.6 whatever you want apply okay whatever you want it's okay then the other portion is here i am writing for what i am updating this schedule what is the purpose of updating this schedule okay to modify this one uh, if i am updating this schedule for the weekly progress report you can say the weekly progress report then uh, the number sign then for with number sign 0 
zero thread okay also enter and uh, in width and then set the font word italic and twelve okay okay apply weekly progress reports width is down you can set the width apply okay still not okay apply back more yeah. then also you have to page for the page setup you have to set the page fonts this one because the fonts is necessary 12 okay apply sorry okay apply you can see here the page setup page numbers page one of one weekly progress book here what you write the revision box the revision box what is the revision box title here you can uh, write your name who is prepared by or updated by or updated on i am preferring the updated updated on i am preferring the date here on uh, just say 22nd of uh, jan 20 21st okay here you can add the more rows to revision first date uh, date revision first is uh, on 17th just say the 17th revision number uh, revision 01 okay check by client with uh, client name you can write the client and move uh, check by consultant or check by the name which is your manager or something just say planning manager manager and then from the client whatever planning department or client you can write a planning department okay apply you can see here the planning department <coughs> also you can see the you can adjust from here okay apply then you have to adjust this one also okay apply planning department planning manager okay also you can change the font of this one also from here uh, bold italic okay hit okay apply that font is already changed if there is any other revision you can write here the other revision right here you can manage the url revisions at every update you can see the revision and everybody can understand how much revisions are okay the last is now the options time scale start and time scale finish from where to where you want to uh, print this one earliest project start select this one and then the custom date or the project finish you can custom date the project finish date the finish date of the project you can custom okay custom date like uh, say the, our project finish date is march okay it's okay now you can see select the which one you want to print these all are want to print okay apply okay now the second issue is uh, just for uh, little if you want to print uh, uh, with your resource loading sheet this is your resource loading and you can again print go to the options option now you can select the profile if you want to print the profile with your project apply okay this is your project profile if you want to print the separate i am also uh, define this one also okay now we will print with the profile then we uh, print the profile with the separate activity separate and get that separate okay first of all print print your uh, select your printer okay uh, just say i want to save on desktop give the name of your file 
PDF is creating. You can see here the project, your project. This is printed. Again, I want to print and change to options. Some option. I'll go to the options. I want to only activities, grid lines, and this one. This one you can see. You will print this one. I want to print this uh, profile and profile separate. And this is separate. Okay. There is no profile. You can print. Okay, PM, like say zero one, on uh, save on desktop. Okay, I'm mostly preferring that this Nitro Pro, Nitro Pro software because this result is hundred percent uh, accurate and uh, resolution is good and you can the page margins each and everything is good. You can see here without profile. Now we will go print only profile page setup if you want to print only profile and select all and only select the profile apply okay you can see here the profile okay other things your footers and headers will remain same if you want to write something here on weekly progress report profile something you want to change you can change okay apply okay then print again just uh, save say the profile as curve profile on desktop save you can see only the profile whatever you want to print if you want to print directly to the printer you can also print directly to the printer now the other thing i want to tell you you have to say after this setting your setting you have to uh, save your layout view go to the view as i already explained save layout okay save layout view save layout as whatever your desired for this layout is for just for your weekly report give the name of the weekly report okay save so when whenever you want to print the week in weekly report say layout which report you just go and open the layout i just uh, hide some column remove some column okay apply now i will go again to the layout open layout okay no i don't want to save if you want to save then you can save you can see weekly report i will apply this one and you can see the behavior apply this came same which I we have saved and your print setup will be not changed if you save the layout you cannot set up every day the new print setup you can use the previous print setup as you save this is our today's topic uh, for the next update uh, for the next video I will come up with the theory of the project concentrates uh, I want to def uh, define you the project concentrates how we will add in primavera 6 p6 and how we will use the project concentrates uh, that topic is very necessary and inshallah soon i will upload that topic uh, with theoretical the theory the definition of the concentrate then you can uh, understand the concentrates of the project then we will i'm also working on the prima for the planning and monitoring uh, software planning and monitoring document for uh, updating progress and these all things the standard document i'm working on it when i will prepare the final one i will also that is also theoretical i will just describe you can read and i will provide the source files of this one procedures planning and monitoring procedure i will provide also the source file you can modify according to your company but that is authentic and according to quality management systems and ISO requirements and planning standards with it, which I am covering the all topic. You can just download and modify according to the company because the clients is mostly required with documents as a 
contract deliverables i will provide these all thing and next uh, i am going also going to prepare earn value sheets and uh, dashboard and flash reports these all things i will provide with the formats on uh, with the video describing the how we will update with the source file the and everything thanks for watching please subscribe our channel and comment how we we are going on thank you allah hafiz